Hi, Mark Camosio, Gunmark TV. We've got quite an attractive traditional spring piston brake barrel gun here. And this is the Kamita Phoenix 400 Compact Star. Now we tested recently the USC laminate version and that's the, um, pretty much the same power plant brake barrel action. That USC stood for ultra short carbine. Now on this one we've got a, a longer barrel and it's got this uh, foresight assembly so you've got the um, sort of moderator there and it's also got an integral foresight that's the only negative because that is a bit looks a bit vulnerable there I can't help thinking that's a little bit vulnerable because you're going to be putting your hand there to cock it but um, you just respect that it could do with a little bit of a hood otherwise you've got um, nice bright open sights and so they've got the finger wheel adjustable rear sight there with the green fiber optic elements Moving back, you've got a dovetail rail, and it's got provision for there's, there's holes drilled into the receiver for the for an arrestor block, etc., which would be you really want to use on a spring gun. Very nice little uh, push button and safety catch there at the back. That's um, automatic on this actually, so you just push that forward. It looks a bit it's sort of reminiscent of the old Farmer Bell Sport there. Very attractive hardwood stock see the laser cut checkering um, on here and uh, that, that I like that angled forend as well it's quite comfortable but it sort of gives it a bit more style coming back here you've got the adjustable cheek piece now obviously that's a key feature on these and it makes a big difference obviously just stick an allen key in there slightly adjust it and then you can raise and lower the, the, the comb as as you need to it works works a treat on it the stock is ambidextrous but easily usable but you know from everybody but having that cheek piece adjustable it really does elevate the the eye scope alignment uh, butt pad on there obviously a bit hard but um, does the job but yeah, overall, very attractive rifle. Got a two-stage trigger, and again, that the the feel on this is is, is pretty good. It's it's way above average in use, and you've got a nice broad blade there, so a comfortable trigger use. It's good. I'm a, I'm quite a fan of these in general. These um, Kamita Phoenix. It's been around for a while, but there's been various different um, different versions, and they sort of evolved the system. But uh, we'll just put a put a few shots through. So it's like brake barrel. It's quite a thorough lock up on this so to release it I'll just jolt it over the knee pull it down there you can feel the spring inside but it's it's pretty smooth and then push your pellet home as usual always make sure it's flush so it's lower than the o-ring and obviously then you're not going to fail the breach and keep the pellet as obviously you want a consistent launch so you're pushing that in to the same extent and you're also protecting the pellet shut that up everything's really solid thumb off the safety and you're away actually pretty slick sounding action on this so you can you can hear the spring whilst you're cocking it but the actual firing cycle very slick quick and not much resonance at all yeah i must say overall feels quite sophisticated pretty good trigger there's um, not too much weight on that it's trippy you can feel it just a little bit of creep and then it wants to go and a real snap to the action so they've obviously uh, paid some attention to the internals as well but yeah it's uh, an attractive gun and it's a, it's a great sort of general purpose sporter but I'm, I'm a big fan of these that's the Kometa Phoenix 400 compact star